Former Vice President Annette Liu has criticised her own party for its handling of the nomination process in the run-up to the Taipei mayoral election. After months of indecision, the DPP has announced that it will hold a convention and internal poll this weekend, announcing the party's mayoral candidate on Monday. But Liu says that she was not consulted about the poll before it was announced. <laughs> Annette Liu, who is seeking the DPP's nomination to run in Taipei's mayoral election, was all smiles when she bumped into the KMT's mayoral candidate Ding Shouzhong by chance on the campaign trail. But when talk turned to yesterday's discussions with her own party's campaign committee, her mood soured quickly. The regulations and the nomination procedure don't mention polls. It's not that they can't hold a poll. It's that yesterday nobody mentioned it during our negotiations. Why was a poll suddenly announced after we had all left? We could make a decision without conducting a poll. We could also recommend a candidate to the chairwoman, that's right. But everybody thinks that there should be a basis for our decision. She also expressed her dissatisfaction toward DPP caucus whip Ke Jianming, who turned her down when she wanted to visit the party at the legislature, where her rival Yao Wenzhi works. At Chen Shui-bian's fundraising gala, I asked Ke Jianming personally, and he turned me down instantly. His reason was that Yao Wenzhi himself is a legislator, and so paying a call to the legislative yuan would be awkward. The party caucus typically does not accept visits from any candidate. I can't make an exception to that or set a precedent, so I hope that the vice president can forgive any inconvenience I've caused her. Annette Liu held nothing back as she voiced her discontent, bringing a striking candid tone to the table as the DPP nears the end of its dithering over Taipei.